night. Ooh, no. I love this subject. You, you, she allowed you to fuck her on the, on that night. So why is she expecting? Is it a problem? Is it a problem because you fuck on the first night? I, I don't really know how how I wouldn't expect anything after that. I mean, so 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 yeah. So but, no, I'm with a man but, who said he claimed I raped him. Like get out of here. I, I do know I. <laughs> Claims. He, he, he claims. Don't fucking he fucking lie because he never said no. That's me, y'all. <laughs> That's, a That's key me. Factor in rape. You gotta say no. If, if I woke oh, up, oh, if oh, I time woke out, up, time I'm pointing to the North Pole. Like I'm not gonna say no, but I'm like, what is happening? Time out. Time did out. I consent so, to this? So, How did I get to this way? So I mean, aren't there allegations in the the press right now talking about people? Hold who, up, wait. Who, and I got something real serious to say about that because because okay. like I I feel like. I want to shame all the women who are doing it for a coin because let's just talk about the little girl who was raped or molested in her house at a daycare center or whatever. She's been sexually harassed, but she don't have no one to vent to. She's petrified to talk to somebody about it, but you guys are doing it for a coin. Not really because you, you know what I mean? Want to bring light to the issue or anything. I think there is a responsibility um, on both parts. I mean, as far as the the yeah. the aggressor and the victim, because if you don't want to be in that situation, it all depends on how the situation is being approached to you. If if he's holding a knife or a yeah, gun to you, yeah, that's, yeah. and you know, but I think the realistic. But of the- if if it's just you <coughs> just want to, you, you can walk out the room. And then it's the whole thing when we're here, when people are going on dates and a guy just attempted to have sex with them and then they said no, but they're saying just the attempt, like he sent her a text. A question is sexual harassment. Right. But, the, but we can't, we can't. You don't lump, know until you ask. <laughs> but we can't, exactly. But that, but we can't, we can't lump the things together. I mean, yeah, I we can't it. say, if, like you mentioned, the little girl that would get abused mm-hmm. and then a, a adult woman who's just approached and then she's given the opportunity to like choose. But it's like she's approached by a millionaire or billionaire. Yeah. So now it's like, if I was approached by a billionaire millionaire today, I'm talking about it today. I'm not going to wait until, you know, you 10 years later but, or something to try but, to make a profit. But my whole... Join this civil... Action. My whole thing is just because you're approached by a guy doesn't mean to. he didn't he assaulted you. Just because he I mean, I I think it, <clears throat> it it's it's just a part of human culture or human nature to you know, I was sexually harassed at, at my high school. We went to the same high school. Can y'all guess who sexually harassed me? Probably one of the security guys. Security and, <laughs> no. I was a teacher? Yes. The gym teacher or the no. art teacher. We talked about we talked about no. this on the first uh, podcast, uh, and, and the, the he was a names. science teacher, Mister. Uh, I mean, no, yeah, we, we don't we don't say names. Yeah, but he was a science teacher. <clears throat> we, I, I'll say his name if I think about it. If, if he if he's out there sexually harassing, uh, he but is. but at the same time we like, need to we need to say his name. Then I mean, if you're gonna bite, you're gonna bite. Just just like what what D was just saying. You know what I'm saying? Harvey Weinstein. A lot of these women look like, okay, this is my chance to get on. Yes. So Russell Simmons, the bitch said yeah. she's seventeen. She was seventeen, but then it's like she, she didn't deny it. He just she, said it was consensual. She and I cons- yeah. him. She consented. And look, his wife was like seventeen when he met her. She, Kamara was yeah, come on. Yeah. Listen, she consented. But she was bad. But, he knew he was about to raise that thing up. But you she, know she, 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 <laughs> she did it. <laughs> Raise that thing up. She, she, hey. You gotta, you gotta do it like Tiger. You got a red shirt, or you know what I'm saying. You yeah. gotta put her on the bench, wait till she turned 18, and then you can do what you're gonna do. He, but she had potential, so he knew. Yeah, that. but this person that came out on Russell Simmons, like nobody like knew what she been late recently. Well, I mean, she listen, they did, they're they're there for they're there for the glow up, but like Russell they're Simmons said, glow. you know, we want to respect their feelings, her feelings. Oh, and he's his a vegan. Feelings. I love him. <laughs> He, he's the vegan. Contra- <laughs> contradiction. He respects the women's. He respects the women's feeling. He, he don't eat no meat. <laughs> but you right, I mean, got like a whole documentary. It's a whole documentary out there. But but the funny thing is, you know what I'm saying. As a man in power, you're always gonna be susceptible. Yes, to, you are. You know what I'm saying. But, like the poison is out there. Quite, and you may be poisoning yourself. Quite, 40, but 45 got all these allegations, but he's still listen, y'all president. Listen, 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 though. 
Oh, he got man. But no, this, he, he don't have allegations. He got pictures it, where but, he's <laughs> grabbing girls or everything. But here's here's the thing. I, I just want to bring this up. But we always talk about the guy who uses his power to get sex. Don't talk about the women. But we never talk about the women who use the sex to get power. Because please believe, if you've ever had any power over employees or in general, just if you have power over the opposite sex, you're going to get plenty of offers by the opposite sex. I can believe that. Uh, yeah. That's why, I, I mean, it, 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 it just seems to me for a powerful person... Or, or a person who has experienced a little, a little, little bit of power in my day, yeah. you know. I had a, you know, but <laughs> you, you, you get. I, I've like got a turn. You like hold up. I got to do this, and then that. No, no, you know, and it, it's, it's sometimes hard to do because they'd like look. I don't want nothing but that thing. What you going to do? And you'd be like ah. But you, you know, yeah, you want to make it. <laughs> so wait, if you're attracted to that person, are you like ah, uh, or are you like what's up? Let's well, do this. It's, so for so, me, for me, it's always been, what type of person are you? Are you trying to glow up? You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> are, are you trying? Are you trying to call out and, and, and not get written up? <laughs> but look, <laughs> I'll, I'll give you like for? the perfect example. Hugh Hefner, rest in peace. True. Legend. Yes. Legend. You know what I'm saying? Entrepreneur, mogul. We love him. You know what I'm saying? But Hugh had his own show. Had three wives. And all these motherfuckers got famous. He had three side chicks. Three side chicks. Well, all three of, and side chicks. Well, all three of his side yes. chicks got, got famous. Two sisters. Mm-hmm. What, what was it? Uh, Holly. Uh, what, what was it? Kendra. Kendra. Kendra got her own TV show. All, all, all three of them just got famous. She These are his three main. Yeah, three. Had allegations of fucking yes, I made that bitch famous. Yeah, but but at the same, but at the same time, she guess what? I'm sorry if Hugh Hefner wasn't Hugh Hefner. You telling me you just banging this old man just for kicks and giggles? Mm-hmm. No, you banging him for what he can do for you. And guess what? Wait, wait, Anna Nicole Smith. Because he's Hugh. Yeah. Hefner, so. so and guess what? Hugh Hefner. Yeah, she came- all the way he probably Q was probably a great person. He was good to these women. He, he seemed real humble. Yeah, he was. He was very humble. But at the same time, you know what I'm saying? He was having his fun. They was having their fun. You know what it was. Same with like Harvey Weinstein. You know what I'm saying? If he's when the chick said he told me to sit in his lap, I sat in his lap because you ain't had to sit in his motherfucking lap. You sure didn't. You could have walked out. No means no. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to say right. this, but like sometimes, like I'm so happy. Like, I got to put my fist up to be black. Because I just don't see no white nigga telling me to do something I'm doing because I think he's white. <laughs> nigga, I will cuss you out. Nigga, fuck you. <laughs> Bitch, who well, are you talking to? I'm just, it's not like it hasn't happened. You don't know my mother. <laughs> no, well, no, I'm, I'm not saying you, but what you got to understand, this stuff has been going on for years. So now society is turning the table. These, like, people are saying they have the opportunity. Like, D said, you know what I'm saying? Like. Things go on. These women may or may not say nothing. The time is right to say something right now, whether you're a victim or not a victim. And it's like mm-hmm. we not we not they saying. This, so did you guys see like they had this blackout moment on um, Instagram? You made your uh, post black if you were sexually harassed. A whole lot of actresses like Viola Davis from How to Get Away with Murder. Yeah, a lot of them. And now, I was surprised when you say sexually what. What? They didn't so, tell that story. What, it was just like kind of like I'm you saying me I too. I was first of all. Let, let me just tell you how I was mad because you know when after the Trayon Trayvon Martin thing happened, we supposed to turn our screens black and stuff. Mm-hmm. So I just didn't like that they used the both the, those things. And I'm not on social media, yeah, so same. I don't miss me. Yeah, that was retarded, but I didn't like that. Okay, but what I'm saying is. Then we gotta define again what is sexual harassment. Like what? Because we, we, it can be anything. My, though. So my, they like like ha- say sexual harassment can be verbal, right? Physical, yeah. I, I'm not I, sure. I, no, I no, I understand. It but can't. What, it's, it's, what it's, I'm no listen. I, I get what you're saying. No, what I'm, no, all I'm saying is you ready to go to sleep. We cannot put someone. Just having a genuine interest in a person and approaching them as an adult in the same category of someone violently raping somebody. Yeah, 
But that's what it's becoming. It appears that like you are sexually harassed mainly in the work environment. I, but I but it happens all okay, the time so, though. So I mean, but some people say catcalling, a guy hollering at a girl uh, from a distance or commenting on her body. You know, how cat- many times did that happen in Southeast? Oh. <laughs> well, first of all, you said you said in Southeast standards change. <laughs> well, but but that's my point. It does exactly. That's my point. Some some people cl- some people will say. That is sexual assault or sexual harassment. Yeah, you know wh- wh- where do we draw the line? I but, mean, so so in my opinion, society sets the rhythm, they set the pace to where we draw the line. Okay, when things get in social media or in the media, like it gets so big, somebody.